Hello, my name is Holly Knutz McCullough and I'm the Chief Curator of Fine Arts and Exhibitions at the Telfair Museum of Art. And we are standing in the Jepson Center for the Arts, which opened in March of 2006. And uh, this fabulous building was designed by Moshe Salty. These are the steward galleries, actually this one, and the adjoining gallery. And they look very similar. They're similar in size. The two of these galleries together give us about an additional 5,000 square feet of exhibition space, which is about what we have total at the Telfair Academy. So when this building opened, it gave us opportunities and space to host shows like this that we simply couldn't have brought in to the Telfair Academy. And as you can see, the steward galleries have a really wonderful shape. All of the galleries have this sloping ceiling that gives us this nice vertical height on one wall and lots of space for large-scale contemporary art. So currently in this gallery, we have the Kirk Varnado collection installed. Kirk Varnado was, of course, a Savannah native and um, a great curator at the Museum of Modern Art and art historian. And these works were assembled in his honor following his death and in honor of the opening of the Jepson Center with the help of his widow, Ellen Zimmerman. So this is the Lewis Gallery. This is a gallery that we often devote to southern artists, both local and regional, although we also um, do other projects in here. It depends on our needs, but currently this gallery is showing the work of Luther Vann, who is a really terrific local artist and whose imagery is very much drawn um, from his own personal life in Savannah and from uh, you know Savannah community in general. Well, we're about to go onto the Moore Sculpture Terrace. We actually have two sculpture terraces, one larger and one small. And uh, this is a wonderful outdoor space in which we have a number of large-scale sculptures. The ceiling is a suspended glass ceiling, and it's the only one of its kind in North America. And uh, it, it's very beautiful. It's designed to allow as much light as possible to enter the atrium area. Um, we are able to suspend art from the ceiling, but only very, very lightweight objects. So we're in the process of trying to identify pieces that will work. But certainly it's an important and beautiful part of the architectural structure of the building.